A recent study has found that fishes and other forms of marine life are getting addicted to drugs such as crystal meth, which is being flushed down the toilet by humans. Scientists say that drug addiction is changing the behavior of many fish, with some drugs making the fish do things that they usually would not do. And when the drugs are taken out of the waterways, the fish are seen to suffer from withdrawal symptoms. This discovery was made after it was observed that some trout fish, commonly found in freshwater rivers, were exposed to methamphetamine, also known as crystal meth. Scientists fear that such behavior could have alarming evolutionary and ecological consequences for marine wildlife. Experts believe that fish receive greater amount of gratification by satisfying their drug cravings than engaging in activities such as foraging or mating. Scientists conducted an experiment wherein they isolated a group of trout fish in a tank of water laced with methamphetamine for eight weeks. The results showed that the trout soon became addicted to the substances in the water. Afterwards, the fish were transferred to a freshwater tank with no drugs in it. Researchers then checked the fish for any drug withdrawal symptoms. Every other day, the trout fish were offered a choice between freshwater or water containing methamphetamine. Tracking their choices, it was clear that the trout that had spent time in the contaminated water were addicted to the drugs. It was also observed that the fish suffered from withdrawal during the first four days of being moved to freshwater before selecting water containing the drug. If the fish had become addicted, they would seek the drug when it was available. In addition, the addicted trout fish were less active than those trout fish that had never experienced the drug. The researchers found that, after the methamphetamine was withdrawn, the residue of the drug was still active in the fish's brains for up to 10 days. It has also been noted that drug addiction could also drive fish to congregate near unhealthy water treatment discharges in search of a fix, as well as disturbing their natural tempo of life. All in all, drug abuse is harming aquatic ecosystems, just like it harms human societies. Anyways, that is all for this video. I hope you had a good time. Please smash that like button and subscribe to this channel for more. Thank you and take care.